Paul was writing in 1 Thessalonians, he used that same word that would be called up. Amen. But let me go a little bit further than that with it. It doesn't just mean to get caught up in something. It means to catch up or grasp hastily. Come on. Yeah. Other words, there you were, there you go. Yeah. Amen. And that about that quick a response, just jerk and snatch them out of there and they're gone. That's what it's talking about. To snatch up, to lift. But I like this, to transport. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, wow. Oh. To transport. You can call it what you want to. Amen. But there ain't no elevator ever done me like that. Amen. There ain't no zip line ever done me like that. Amen. But whenever that thing takes place on that day, I might be walking around out the woods somewhere doing a survey. Amen. Take one step to go to some property corner and everybody look around and say, where did he go? Amen. Because just that fast, amen, I'm going to leave here and I'll be gone. I'm telling you that there will be an imminent rapture of the church of the Lord Jesus Christ. And he's coming back for a people that's made ready to meet him. It's a promise from the Father. We can depend on it. We can bank on it. It will come to pass. Yeah. Hallelujah. He will one day snatch his church out of here. It's going to come so fast that the world's not going to know what hit it. That's right. Amen. I thought about this. They spent all night long. Moses said, Stand still and see the salvation of the Lord. Held his rod. The waters stand back. Took them all night long to cross over that Red Sea on dry ground. Come on. When they get to the other side, Pharaoh is starting to come in behind them. And now the Lord just decides to go, let the waters fall down again and drown them in the water. My, my, one of my favorite parts there when I read that he sent the angels to take the wheels off their chariots. Yes, amen. Hallelujah. They drove hard. And they couldn't get through there. Tell me God don't have a sense of humor. Amen. Can you see them trying to get through there? There goes the children of Israel. We're going to go after them. And all of a sudden they look back. They don't know what's going on. But their buggies are fine. Everything that they have is fine. And all of a sudden they look at buggy wheels. Are slinging off yeah. to the left and to the right. We can't get through there. And then walk to the place there. I'm telling you that was a deliverance. As man understands it. And man knows about the Lord Jesus Christ. But that one took all night long. But there's going to be a time. There's going to be a moment. Yeah. When the Lord sets up on the cross. Of glory and Gabriel sounds that trumpet. There'll be not a lot of team, but it's going to be in an instant, in the twinkling of an eye, and the church is going to be snatched out of here, and it will be gone. Amen. Hallelujah. I don't know about you, but I'm waiting on that. I feel like preaching. You got, uh, we got what, 12? 12, 10? Amen. I'm going to, thank you. Amen. The next word, though, out of that Greek word that is there is a word that we've come in constant use of. Out of that word is 